Hello again and welcome to our next training movie. We like to show you now, how to start a new project. To start a new project, open the Sophistic Structural Desktop. If there is no SSD icon on your desktop you can start the program by choosing it in the Windows Start menu. Create a new project. Select a directory where your project should be saved. Choose a name for the database. The file with the ending star.sophistic is the main project file where all information about your project input will be saved. In the title section you can enter a name for your project. Here the design code has to be chosen. For our slab, we will use the pre-settings. Also the system 2D slab doesn't have to be changed. Here the group divisor can be modified. But we will work with the default values in our example. Next you can choose the units for input, the input language and change the boxed values. For system and load definition, we will use the graphical pre-processing SOFI Plus. The drawing with all input will be saved as DWG file. Thus the files with the endings .sophistic and .dwg are sufficient to reopen and recalculate a project. For the calculation, you have to define the orientation of the dead load and select the program module you want to use. It is important to know that the settings for the coordinate system and the norm cannot be changed subsequently. You can find a video tutorial on our info portal showing you how to save a project without a specific code as a template. Now the screen is split into two areas, the task tree for navigation and the working area. The SSD is task oriented. Each step in modeling, calculation and design is represented by one task. All the tasks are assigned to groups, usually named as, system, linear analysis and design area elements. The tasks and groups you can see now were chosen automatically by the program due to your choices in the system information dialog. Using the right click menu, you can delete tasks, add new ones, and of course also new groups if you want to have a different structure. You can rename tasks and groups to get an individual input. In this movie, we showed you how to start a new project. All necessary settings inside the system information dialog were discussed. Finally we had a first look into the SSD main window to see the command, navigation, and working area. Thank you for watching this tutorial movie.